Big day for the manager. A 50th game in charge. Can he celebrate with a victory? Next on EA TV. Well, most of the fans in attendance here have had to bring their umbrellas and wear their raincoats. It's a soggy day for this match. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And the focus is on the Bundesliga. Live action coming up. It's St. Pauli up against Borussia Mönchengladbach. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Well, he didn't miss by all that much. Well, he struck it quite nicely, but the keeper was always in control of the situation. He knew that was going wide. And here's how it looks for Borussia Mönchengladbach. Jan Sommer is the goalkeeper. Christoph Kramer starts alongside Emre Can in the centre of midfield. And the striker of choice in this setup is Alassane Player. And the flag has gone up offside. Well, something that really needs to be tightened up for the hosts is the defensive situation. Look at the statistics. It's the worst defence in the league, Stuart. Well, defending has to start from the front. And this season, the forwards haven't put enough pressure on their opponents. That's why it's so difficult for the rest of the team to make good defensive decisions. It's been really poor from the front players. Goal news to bring you from the Stadion and the Alten Försterei. Alex, who has found the net? It's a goal for Augsburg. It's now 1-0 with 11 minutes played. Cheers, Alex. Well, that's a well-timed pass. And cleared away. Well, for St. Pauli, a case of trying to bounce back after a defeat last time out against Bayern. How do you anticipate it going this time, Stuart? Well, it was a poor defensive display, wasn't it? Today, they just need to show a bit more ambition going forward. Then they'll get a better performance and a possible outcome. I think a draw is the most likely result. How well, can they open up the defence here? Player and throwing himself at the ball. Short corner it is. And routine for the keeper in the end. The cross far too close to him. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. Well, we spent a bit of time with the manager ahead of kickoff. I think he was the most surprised to hear that it's his 50th game in charge today, Stuart. Well, in the modern game, that's a lot of matches. But of course, all that matters today is a good result. But overall, I think he's done okay. Stefan Leiner. Plenty of running room in the wide position. Can he play it in? That's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. Well, they might be onto something. Can he put it away? A goal here! Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, here's the replay, and just look how close this is. May not have been given in my day, but the technology's certainly shown its worth here. One nil then. Getting in there to intercept. Mohamed Kamara. Now can they make something happen? But nothing comes of it.
Stefan Leiner. Jonas Hofmann on the ball. And a bad pass it was. Fine. Flag up, tight offside. Alassane player. He's got the right idea with that pass. Well, nothing productive, really. Schindler. Can they keep it out? Not a decisive punch by the keeper. And the keeper hangs on at the second attempt. Well, he's done really well, hasn't he? Great stop, and then the reaction. Camara. Now, what can they do from here? Well, possibilities inside the box. Wonderful chance! What an important piece of defending. The clearance wasn't decisive. Well, they can bring it out now. Lars Stindl. Well, it's one pass after another. Stefan Leiner. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. And that is going to be a free kick. Well, just a warning on this occasion. Might have decided to hand out the yellow card. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Well, no stopping him. Agu. And there it is. The half-time whistle is sounded. No doubt about it, the home... Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Tony Villa. Playa. Can they put it away? And the referee has given them a corner. Over it comes. Well, it was a poor attempt. And a goal kick it is. And goal news to bring you from the Stadion under Alten Försterei. Somebody has scored there, but who? Alex Scott. It's a goal for Union. The score's level again now at 1-1 with 49 minutes played. Alex with the info as ever. Well, that ball looks promising. Can he finish? No shortage of excitement. Level again. No wonder they're excited. Well, here's the replay, and it has been coming. They've played some great football in this game, and they fully deserve this goal. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. One, one. Agu. Ibrahima Ndiaye. Possession given away, unfortunately. But it does go with the territory. Bayern, big club that they are, forever being linked with new players. But it does appear they're about to get their man, Stuart. Yes, the rumours suggest... Oh, wait, Stuart, they might score! Just couldn't get it through. Couldn't put it away. Offside, however. Well, he'll certainly be pleased to see the flag go up there because that was a poor miss. And time for the change now. Karim Adeyemi, clean challenge. Pressing high to win the ball. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Bon Sabaini. Tony Villa. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. And the keeper there to deal with it. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? 
Hoffman sends it back. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Well, just take a look at the stats. They've certainly created enough chances to be ahead by now. They really need to start taking one or two of them to press home their advantage. Kamara. Karim Adeyemi. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Bolsabaini. On the ball, Zakaria. Well, just a quick reminder, more live football coming your way here on EA TV. I think you might enjoy this game. I like the look of that game. The atmosphere is always good inside that stadium and two very good teams. Player. Well, when all was said and done, he's failed to hit the target. Agu, fine. Ball with Klinter. Janes Horn. Useful looking position, you've got to say. A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. Well, he'd been warned before, and now he's been booked. And he's under big pressure now. He's going to have to tread really carefully here. Well, what a final few minutes we have here. And the fans are certainly playing their part. But can they take one of these chances that come their way and win this game? Well, this should be a really absorbing Bundesliga match coming up on EA TV. It's Borussia Mönchengladbach versus Stuttgart. And a chance to whip it in here. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Felix Agu. Only five minutes left for play and tension galore with the teams locked together. Gets it a go. Superb block. Hoffman. Now with Stindl. And they're on the front foot, looking for a winner near the end of this game. They really look after the ball when they have it. Bonsabaini. High echelon goalkeeping there. Well, the two sides still locked together. And a set piece, a corner, can make all the difference. And there it is, the full-time whistle. Well, they can't be separated. And goals...